Right before Christmas, an East Moline man had a wooden bear sculpture stolen from his front yard. But as News H. Joe McCoy reports, that bear was destined to return home. In the early morning hours on December 21st, longtime quad citizen Don Ziegler had his beloved six foot tall, 500 pound wooden bear stolen from his driveway. A bear he bought in 1996 for $100 per foot. It's just hard to have somebody take something that you care about. A neighbor's security camera caught the culprit pulling out of Don's driveway, but it was impossible to tell who it was. This is the bear when Don lived in Moline, a sculpture that means much more to him and his family than just a solid walnut log. My grandkids are all in college now. They just all hugged it and loved it, and it's been photographed a, a lot. Don took to Facebook to see if anyone knew where the bear was. The post ended up being shared 170 times, the outcrying of support making him emotional, especially when his former military friend reached out. I was reading this text and I, in the garage here and I started getting teary-eyed, kind of emotional about why a big old tough marine guy, that he, he shared my story of my bear. And it just overwhelmed me with all the love and support. Don called his insurance agent to see if the bear was covered. As soon as his agent saw the picture, she knew it looked familiar. The bear had shown up in her neighborhood just a few days ago. She called police, they picked up the bear, and returned it home. Police told Don after the bear was stolen, it was sold to a homeowner in Rock Island for $200. I never expected to get the bear back. The thief has not been caught, but all that matters to Don is that his bear is back where it belongs. In East Moline, Joe McCoy, WQAD News 8. And Don posted a $100 reward for anyone that could find the bear. He plans to give that $100 to his insurance agent.